Right. You know what to do. You're in the area. How does she fancy a drink? You show your face and you say nothing, okay? And whatever you do, keep that scarf on. You'll catch your death. Fez, hi. Tony Gordon here. I wonder, could you do me a favour? Yeah, I think it's time Marie and I had a little talk. And I'd be grateful if you'd be there to help smooth things over. The Rovers? Yeah. That's excellent. Jed Stone! My goodness! Yes, what a surprise. The things people have been saying about you disappearing, I was beginning to believe them. Uh, yeah, well, Emily mentioned it, you see, but here I am, large as life and twice as ugly. Hey, let me buy the drinks, yeah? Lame and Al. Biggest comeback since Lazarus. Did you know he was alive? You didn't really think I'd killed him, did you? Excuse me. Sorry. Oh. Hello, Mrs. Connor. What are you doing? I thought you would... He's... He told me that he killed you. Well, as you can see. You said we were on to him, Jed. And then, and then you just disappeared at that. It wasn't like that. I, I just got hold of the wrong end of the stick and, and me and Tony, we, we sorted that between us. No need to introduce you two, then. You've bought him off, haven't you? You told the police this morning he killed him, so make up your mind. Hey, Looney Tunes, where are you going? Where's the apology? I think she's got the message. She won't go shouting her mouth off again. Let's listen. You didn't want to talk to Maria, did you? You just wanted her to see Jed. I'm sorry for the deceit. I had no other way of getting her into the pub. And I wanted to have to see him with her own eyes. Hey. So you set this whole thing up without telling me? I didn't want to spoil the surprise. I must admit I uh, misjudged the man. But I'm not alone in that. Oh, Mr. Gordon certainly has its critics. Well, if they can see the flat he got me, they'd soon change the tune. Wigan's a long way away, though, isn't it? Considering you've lived around Weatherfield all your life. Far enough. I must confess, I didn't have Tony Gordon down as a man given to such generous gestures. Oh, but as a Christian, you, you must approve of a sinner repenting. Oh, absolutely. Emily, taxi's on its way. Could you get the cab, please? Yeah, well, yeah, of course. Thanks. <laughs> taxi's waiting. Uh, but, but I'm enjoying myself. It's booked and paid for. Oh, right, really. Uh, well, it, it's been lovely. Well, see you soon, I uh, hope. Uh, Wigan's uh, a long way, mate. There we are. Oh, it was lovely to see you. And you. And I think what you've done is an example to us all. You're very kind. Now, take care and keep in touch. Do you not understand the phrase, overstaying your welcome? I was saying nice things about you. I didn't need a testimonial from you, just an appearance. Now, if I see you or your cat in Weatherfield again, the last thing you do, understood? I don't want to come back here ever! Good. 